all nursing faculty have an office in the Mercy Wing of our new building. These offices provide space for the faculty to work, including the ability to have private meetings with students. Having all offices in the same building has provided the unique opportunity for faculty and therefore programs to work more closely together as we move towards a more centralized department structure. The nursing department has six dedicated classroom spaces equipped with video recording equipment, overhead projector, computer, and whiteboards. Two of the classrooms seat 18 students each, while four of the classrooms seat 30 students. Additionally, the nursing department has a dedicated computer lab with 28 student stations. The nursing arts laboratories 311 and 511 are located in the mother house. Between both spaces, Mercyhurst has 10 patient care units that include a hospital bed, bedside table, and overbed tray table. There are simulated oxygen, suction, and medical gas hookups above each hospital bed. Students have access to medical supplies needed for use in the lab. We utilize medium fidelity human simulators, Laertal Adults Nursing ANDs with a corresponding sim pad. The sim pads utilize easy to operate scenarios and customized vitals with touchscreen capability. We have a mounted TV above one bed to have a larger display for vitals that connects to the sim pad. We have two control rooms that are between the simulation suites. The control rooms are equipped with a two-way mirror for observers to view activities. We utilize KB port cameras and microphones for viewing and communicating from the control room into the simulation suites. In addition to viewing the simulation through the cameras, we also have the capability to record and dictate notes on the KB port software. The simulation coordinator utilizes laptops that communicate with the Laertal high fidelity simulators in the suite such as changing vital signs, speaking through the simulator, and playing various sounds such as coughing, screaming, and difficulty breathing. We have two debriefing rooms with laptops and flat screen TVs to allow the simulations to be viewed live or played back from a recording. The debrief rooms are set up with oval conference tables and chairs to promote communication and collaboration among the students. We utilize this space for pre-briefing activities and review, watching the live feed during the active simulations, and following the simulation for the debriefing sessions. Our adult simulation suite is a simulated hospital room that is equipped for video recording and monitoring through the KB port. The lab is equipped with headwalls with simulated working oxygen, medical air, and suction that is controlled by a compressor. Vital signs are displayed on a mounted monitor. The lab includes both a medication and crash cart. Laertal's High Fidelity SimMan 3G is utilized in this space. This simulation suite includes equipment for video monitoring and recording by KB Port. The lab is equipped with compressor-controlled simulated oxygen, medical gas, and suction outlets. Our additional equipment includes one labor and delivery bed, one hospital-grade radiant warmer, and a hospital bassinet. Vitals are displayed on a bedside monitor. In the maternity suite, we utilize Laertal Sim Mom with automated delivery system with newborn, and Laertal Newborn Ann with a dedicated sim pad. This simulation suite includes equipment for video monitoring and recording by KB Port. The lab is equipped with compressor-controlled simulated oxygen, medical gas, and suction outlets. Additional equipment that is utilized in the pediatric simulation suite includes a hospital-grade crib and hospital gurney. Vital signs are displayed in real-time utilizing a bedside monitor. We utilize Laertal's nursing baby and Sim Jr. 